All right, today we got a 2001 Chevrolet Suburban. It's the 2500, so it's a three-quarter ton. It's got the 6.0 liter gas engine in it, and automatic transmission, four-wheel drive, 154,000 miles. It's got good rubber on it all the way around. At least 50%, probably more like 75% tread on there. Do a little walk around on it. Body is in decent shape. Um, there is a decent amount of rust down on the rockers. Um, that you can see down there. And we've touched it up just to make it look a little bit better and keep it from rusting as much. But it does have some rust down there. Got the towing package on the back. Um, there's a little, there's a dent right there in that panel. Got the running boards on there. And you can see some of the rust down through there. Some rust right there on that bumper too. This vehicle does have a uh, remote start on it. So you can unlock the buttons, hit the unlock button twice, and then you hold it down and it'll start up. Got the leather interior. You can see there is a rip in it right there. It's got the moonroof. It's got the heated seats. It's got the memory seats. As well as uh, dual power in its front and the passenger seat over there. Stick the key in it. Or else as soon as you touch the brake or gas, it'll shut off. Um, mechanically, runs and drives great. Um, there's no service lights on. Uh, four-wheel driving gauges. It's got the four-wheel drive auto. Um, and the four-wheel drive high. Both those engage. All that works good. And there's your radio. And it is missing the two little knobs there. Um, the climate control works, um, but the AC is not working currently. There's your miles. And another thing I forgot to say, um, this does have the auto ride on it, um, but it has been deleted, which GM had a ton of problems with their auto ride, which it says it on it right here. Um, they had a ton of problems with their auto ride, so a lot of these bigger uh, SUVs have the auto ride on them, but this one's been deleted, um, so you don't have to deal with that. Back seat area. And then there's your third row. Lots of room in there. It's got the double doors on the back. Which I kind of like. The engine compartment.
And I believe that's it. If you got any other questions, feel free to give us a call.